take a look at what's happening around Northwest Arkansas, sponsored by Dr. Pepper and Cream Soda. Now, do you currently have a business and want to learn about uh, technology tools that you, of yeah. course, can use for your business? Well, the Elkins Public Library, now that's a library that we haven't talked about know, in yeah. a while. Uh, they want to help you, so they're hosting a webinar where uh, you can learn about maximizing your web traffic. The event is happening today starting at 1 p.m. and once you register for the meeting, you will receive the Zoom link. Oh yeah, I love that. Now here's a way you can get creative and pay respects to an icon. Inspired by RBG's accomplishments, Painting with Miss Guillory invites you to join her tonight at 6 p.m. and paint Ruth Bader Ginsburg. Social distancing will be observed, so spaces for this class are limited. The cost is $30, and all supplies are included in the cost. Super cool. Um, if you go to that class, send us a picture. Love to we see. We want to see your, your painting. creation. Yeah. That's right. The Ann Cottrell Art Gallery at the University of Arkansas invites you to celebrate the end of their September exhibit. The featured art is from Fayetteville, uh, based photographer Stephen Ironside. Ironside's exhibit is entitled Same Same but different, oh, yeah. and is inspired by his travels. Uh, the closing night reception is tonight uh, from 6 to 8 p.m. I love it. I love Stephen Ironside's photography. He does great work. And finally, here's a way you can give back. Like many cultural institutions, the Scott Family Amazium relies on the community for support. And when the Amazium temporarily closed from March through July 2020, a significant part of the operating revenue was lost. So here's where you come in. The Amazium has set up the Curiosity Fund. I love the name of this. To help re fuel curiosity so families can continue to explore, discover, wonder, and create. Nice. We've got details on how you can donate to the fund and more information, of course, on all of our happening in NWA stories available on our website, goodaynwa.com. That's right. 